So where there's been an injury to thumb that may have affected the um, ulnar collateral ligament, so this is a often uh, patient running at speed and falling over onto their thumb, the ulnar collateral ligament is on this side between the metacarpal and the proximal phalanx. So what we need to do is to stabilise the metacarpal, which if you've got large hands, you can do it around uh, their hand. So I've stabilised the metacarpal, and I want to see how much movement there is of the proximal phalanx. So by moving it uh, in radial deviation, I'm stressing the ulnar collateral ligament. I want to do that both in extension and flexion. And in this patient, there is good, complete block to movement in the radial direction. Uh, in order to know what's normal for this patient, I would examine the other side as well um, so that I can compare the two to see if they've got increased laxity on the injured side.